the latest on the run-up to the Summer Olympics, all times local to Rio de Janeiro. 10.33 p.m. Brenda Martinez was laying on the track, her head buried in her hands. She seemed prepared for heartache again at the U.S. track and field Olympic trials. She tripped after she charged around the final turn of the 800 meters on Monday, missing out on a top three finish and a coveted spot on the Olympic team for Rio. She had one more chance to make the team in the 1,500 meters. Jenny Simpson and Shannon Robbery grabbed the top two spots, and Martinez and Amanda Eccleston leaned for third before collapsing. Martinez appeared to sob, unable to look at the results on the scoreboard at Hayward Field. But Simpson was watching intently. Once it was official, Simpson ran to Martinez and scooped her into her arms. I'm so proud of you, Simpson said. I'm so proud of you. Martinez had edged Eccleston by 0 .03 seconds. Maybe that can be my story, Martinez said about finally making the team. If I can help someone along the way, don't give up on your dream. 10.08 p.m. Simone Biles is closing in on an automatic spot on the U.S. Olympic women's gymnastics team. The three-time world champion opened the final night of Olympic trials with a solid 15.550 on-floor exercise despite taking a small step out of bounds during her dynamic routine. Biles has a total of 77.4 points through five rotations, nearly two points clear of Lori Hernandez. The top finisher and the all-around is guaranteed a spot on the five-woman Olympic team. The other four positions will be selected at the end of competition on Sunday night. 9.40 p.m. Qualification alert. Matthew Santrowitz made his second Olympic team with a victory in the 1,500 meters at the U.S. track and field trials on Sunday. Santrowitz finished fourth at the London Games. Runner-up Robbie Andrews and third-place finisher Ben Blankenship also are headed to Rio. Lionel Manzano, the silver medalist in the London Olympics, finished fourth and did not make the team.